cutie babes welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna be doing for you guys this look here and I'm gonna be talking through it um, I'm gonna be using some products that I either haven't used yet because I'm trying to do more of these type of videos now so that I can use the products that I haven't used yet so I can try them out so you guys can see so you feel like it right off the bat so it's like a mixture of different things first impressions new stuff um, makeup tutorial, get ready with me, talk through, chit chat, whatever. So yeah, so I hope you guys like this look. This is what I did for you guys today. So um, stay tuned if you wanna see how I came to this. <laughs> I wanna kinda try to do more of these more often and um, just kinda explain to you guys what I'm doing right here, you know, from right here, rather than doing a voiceover. I feel like it's more personal when I talk this way than doing a voiceover. So, um, yeah, but um, I think in the future, as my channel grows, I'd like to do these as like kind of like a Q&A or like if you guys give me a topic to talk about, then I can do it that way. But for now, I'll just be basically telling you what products I'm using and explaining as I apply everything to my face. Start from looking at the viewfinder I just have a habit of looking this way instead of this way but I'm gonna try to look in the camera and um, let me put my mirror directly in front of me so that if I look down I'm looking at the mirror but everything should be in focus and everything I do want to try doing these as a way of kind of using new products that I've purchased like today I'm gonna be featuring a couple of new products I think about three Four. Okay, so I have like four new things that I'll be featuring in this video. I have the Swerve Cream Gel Eyeliner from ColourPop. So you guys can kind of see how that goes on. And I also have the Illamasqua um, Precision Ink Eyeliner. I may or may not use that, I'm not sure yet. And I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Brow Perfect. Is that what it's called? Perfect Brow Pencil. This. Um, I know everybody always talks about the Brow Wiz and the Brow Definer. That's why I'm using the um, Brow, the Perfect Brow Pencil instead because this is a good alternative. I used it the other day and when I say it, it was amazing. But you know, with eyebrows, you don't really have to spend $28 on an eyebrow pencil. You really don't. Like, I was doing just fine using. Um, my 99 cents boutique liner that I got from the beauty supply store and that was doing my brows great but I just wanted to try other things since I am a youtuber and that's what we do so yeah um, yeah so hopefully this video isn't gonna take too long I'm gonna try to fast forward some parts and I'm gonna try to do this as quickly as I possibly can Let's get right into this tutorial. I have no clue what I'm going to be doing, but we'll see when we finish what we got. Alright guys, so first I'm going to start off with my Makeup Forever Step 1 um, Skin Equalizer, and that's this product here. I haven't done a top in so long. And I'm just putting it on my areas that get oily. Basically a T-zone. Okay, so once that's on... Next, I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. And what I like to do is I like to brush them first. And this brush is really coarse, so <laughs> you feel it. <laughs> and then I go ahead and I just line them. I'll zoom in. That's as far as I can go. Okay, so... I basically just line them under like so and at the top I just line them to you know how they're shaped And see that one's done and that one is not you see the difference and do you see how good this pencil is it's really pigmented and it's and this is the color dark brown it's really pigmented and it's really nice um, yeah and then you kind of you can brush it out to kind of make it look a bit more natural 
but um so I do the same thing on the other side and obviously when you go in with your concealer you can clean it up make it smaller do whatever you need to do to it I like to use the LA girl pro HD concealer as most youtubers use this is what I use um, and it's nice because it has this brush tip so what I do with this is I just go around the edge of my brow kind of to the shape and it's gonna look scary at first obviously <laughs> but you know it gets better as we blend and then you do underneath as well And I didn't have to squeeze any product out because at times this um, this particular um, product, when you squeeze it out, it kind of lasts on the brush so you don't really ever have to go back and redo anything. So yeah. So this kind of dries fast so I'm going to go ahead and blend that in like so. I love how I'm trying to like lift back my forehead like it's going to go somewhere. <laughs> and this is a wet beauty blender by the way, it's not dry, <laughs> it's wet. And eyebrows are all done. Okay, so after my brows, I like to go in with my foundation at times or sometimes I'll do my eyes first. Um, in today's case, I'll go ahead and do my eyes first, um, so I'm going to zoom back out a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and do my eyes, um, nothing special, I'm going to try not to be too spectacular. spectacular. So first thing I'm going to do is shake this up. This is my Urban Decay Primer Potion and this is the color Eden and that is what I'm going This is what I'm going to be using to prime my eyes. using the BH Party Girl palette and I'm gonna try to come up with something fun and colorful I guess because it is springtime I haven't done any spring tutorials yet so why not so um, I'm gonna go ahead and take my blending brush and I'm gonna grab this um, mauve color here and I'm gonna just start putting that in my crease ensure that all the other colors I add can blend together really well. Um, most people decide to use a color close to their skin tone. We can do whatever works for you. Um, yeah, and I'm just going to do both eyes at the same time because that's how I do my makeup for real. I do them at the same time. At the same damn time, yep. And then I'm going to take this shadow brush and I'm going to grab this pretty green right here. This like sea foam looking green. I'm just going to pick up some of that product. I'm just going to pack it right on my lid. take a clean like fluffy blending type of brush 
like this, a fluffy eyeshadow brush, and I'm just gonna kind of blend out that crease area some more with this cl clean brush. Cause you just kind of want everything to kind of come together in a good way. Okay, so after I do that, oh, I have some green eyeliner. I'm not gonna go that deep today. So after I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and take another shadow brush, but a smaller, a small shadow brush like so, a clean one. And I'm gonna take a highlight color. You can pick any color you want. Some people just leave their concealer from their um, their eyebrows, and that's their highlight. But I'm gonna go ahead and just add like this little nude shimmery color. You can't really see it, but it's there. The foundation I'm using is the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, the Matte and Poreless Foundation. And I have a review up on this as well, so I'll link it below if I remember. And I just dab it all over my face like so. I was gonna use my brush, but I guess I'll use my beauty blender since that's what I grabbed. <laughs> Okay, so now that I'm done with my foundation, I'm gonna go in with the rest of my eye products. We're gonna take this La Masca liquid liner and we're gonna make a cat eye along the top. Actually, we're not gonna do a cat eye. We're just gonna do a regular straight eye. Straight eye, straight line. <laughs> If you mess up on your eyeliner, don't feel bad. I mess up all the time. I just go back in and blend my eyeshadow in right where the eyeliner is messed up. So then we're gonna go in with our ColourPop Swerve Gel Liner and we're gonna put that in our bottom waterline. And this color, this is really pigmented, so yeah. I'm gonna try to look at the camera, but I know I have to look in the mirror. <laughs> do like concealer and all of that stuff like all over the face today I'll do that in another video where I do like a full like full glam or something so almost finished guys okay so next we're gonna go in with blush we're gonna do this golden type of blush it's called coffee cake and it's by Maybelline dream bouncy and this is more of like a golden Color. So then I'm gonna take this blush brush and I'm gonna be using my Milani Bellissimo Bronze. Next, we're gonna go in with our NYX Curvaceous Lush Lashes Mascara. And I don't know if you guys remember when I showed this to you guys, but it's mascara <laughs> by NYX. Okay. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. So, the next thing we're gonna do is our lips, and what I'm gonna do is line my lips with this um, L'Oreal Brow Stylist Designer Pencil. It's in dark brunette, but I use it as a lip liner. This thing's all cracked. So, we're gonna line our lips. I'm gonna just fill my lip in with that as well. So I'm gonna use this um, Dulce Carmelo. You guys know I used to love this. I use this all the time. Lipstick by Milani. So lastly, I'm just gonna go ahead and spray my Urban Decay D Slick Makeup Setting Spray. Like, yes, darling, yes. And that's the end of this video, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I hope you guys like this look. If you try it, please comment below, link your video, link your Instagram, whatever. And let me see. I love the way that it turned out. And I hope this wasn't too simple for you guys. All right. Later, guys. I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Love you.